Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. This is going to be a another mouse tutorial on this, but this one's on the Red Dragon Centro Forest gaming mouse. This one's actually uh, way better than the one I got did last time. It has it's much easier to like configure and use. Uh, it has it doesn't have the only downside of this uh, mouse driver is that it doesn't have multiple colors. It only has red, which you can edit right here. So if we just turn this up to here. It'll uh, say how fast it's going to blink, like you can turn it down to here, real slow, fast. But if you turn it up all the way over here, it just stops, so it's just a solid color. I'm not going to change that because I like it right in the middle. Uh, we're going to go button assign. This is obviously where you assign buttons, and to be able to select the buttons, you just have to press them. So if you like press 6 right here, which is a scroll up, it'll automatically select it, and you can remap it to whatever you want. This is what I'm using right now, and this is the macro I have assigned. I'm going to show you how to make a macro right now. So what we're going to go ahead and do, and we're going to delete this macro right here, my macro. Uh, we have to cancel the macro, my bad. Alright, so we're going to go to Macro Manager, delete it. Guess we're not. So we're going to press New. You're going to name this whatever you want. It doesn't really matter at all. You're going to go to Loop. You're going to go to, it, it's whatever you want uh, while uh, while holding key down to repeat. This is what I do, so uh, it'll keep going until I release the key. And it's not just like a toggle. I like to keep it on this one. This is the one that is like the best for me. That's what I like to do. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna press record, and then you're gonna press whatever button you want to map. So uh, you're gonna press left click if you want to like make a macro for shooting. So we're just gonna click as fast as we can. All right, and I can just get 20 milliseconds at a time. We just go over here. Oh no. Okay, and then we're gonna delete these that I just made. Make sure you don't delete the wrong one. And then let's just say, uh, right here, see how this one says 1730 uh, ms? You're going to go over here and you're gonna press delete once, and it'll go back down to 20 ms. And you want it always to be at the lowest ms, so you get the highest click speed. So what you're going to do is you're going to press OK. We're just going to click on this button, i.e. forward. We're going to go to Macro, and then we're going to select New. Now we're going to press Apply. We're going to go on like uh, Google. We're going to open up a bunch of tabs, just because. Uh, once this works. All right, and then we're just going to hold it. Laggy, but and then we're going to close the tabs like this. It just works like that, and you just hold the key down, and then it'll stop until it stops. So that's like way more simple than the other one. And then if you guys want the mouse driver that I'm using right now, you guys are going to go ahead and go to this website right here. Uh, link will be in the description for these. If you want like, uh, if you have a keyboard that's by Red Dragon that has it, or this one, you're just going to go on here. You're going to go down to right here. This is the one we're using right now. We're going to click on it. It's going to have a download right here. We're going to go ahead and download that. You're going to need the uh, WinRAR. I'll leave that in the description as well. So you're just going to pull this up, double click setup.exe, press yes, and then it'll pop up. Uh, it popped up with uninstall because I already have it, but I'm sure you want to completely remove Red Dragon. I'm going to say no, it'll pop up with an installation thing for you. And yeah, it's going to pop up with installation for you. So now we're going to go ahead and reopen it since it closed before. I oh, know it looks like we have to. We're going to set it up right now for the first time again. It's going to do that. There we go. Set up wizard. Next, install. Finish. And it automatically launch as long as that's checked. And you have your mouse driver. It really is that easy. And you can also go to profiles, you can rename, uh, edit profiles, stuff like that. You can restore to defaults, which is basically just resetting your mouse. Now DPI, this is where it gets uh, okay. So you're going to see a little button right above your scroll wheel, it's like a little arrow. And if you press that, your DPI will go up based on what you click right here, what I'm doing right now. So if I do stage one and put it all the way up to 1600 DPI, and I go to number one, and then I press apply. It's going to be a little bit faster than it was before since it's on number one. Now if we turn it on stage four right here, now it's really fast. 
Now if we go to advanced settings and the mouse pointer speed, this is where we get this is where it gets bad. So you turn it all the way up, you get super fast mouse pointer speeds. Like this is like really fast. This is remember this is on number one, two, maximum. Or this is maximum. And then obviously mouse scroll speed, we're gonna have to turn this off. Alright, mouse scroll speed. Uh that's just obviously how fast you scroll down, up and down. If you want to go faster, turn it up, down. Double click. So this is the delay between you clicking twice and it responding. So uh, if I, it's going to take like a second to respond. Turn it all the way up. Double click. It's going to instantly respond the second you press it. Double click. Then update. Uh, okay, my bad. Uh, advanced settings, update, upgrade, driver download, support team. This is their support team. Right here. We're not going to do that. And then the button assign, you can just assign anything to do whatever you want right here. Windows key, we can have uh, this, number four, this number four back one right here. Or this front one, open Windows key, I guess. We can press apply and then right here. You can do a whole lot of stuff. You can scroll up, scroll down, launch. You can launch a specific program. Haven't really. Oh, look at that. Uh, where are we going to have it open? You can have it open uh, MS Afterburner. Right, apply, and we're going to press this. It'll open MS Afterburner. And right there, MS Afterburner. I'm just going to turn this off because I'm going to put it on macro. Create a new macro right here. Right here. Well, uh, that's pretty much all this mouse driver has to offer. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. See you guys next time.